All right, so they have some little live aquaria paper here. It's an acc acclimation guide, and it's kind of wet. I would, don't know why. It looks like something might be leaking. I did get um, saltwater fish and freshwater fish. We kind of just put it all in one. But one clear bag is these cherry barbs, which you can see. There's just three of them, but they are very small. Like, I thought they would be bigger. I've had cherry barbs in the past. That's great. One of them did leak. It was my other freshwater. And he's still alive. I don't know what I'm gonna do. There's supposed to be two. I think he's still in here. Found him. All right, that's really not cool that that bag busted. And one of them's completely gone. One of them's alive. Like, I didn't know what to do. I kind of panicked and just put them in. I mean, I'm not just gonna let him die. So, I mean, we'll see how he does. Right now, he's just on the bottom breathing really heavy. We'll see. I'm really upset about my two loaches, but I don't know. I mean, at least it was just one bag, but it is floating heaven in this tank. I mean, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine bags, something like that. And they're all floating for 15 minutes to get the temperature the same. And then I open them all and add some tank water and do the whole acclimating procedure. All right, to go over the order of what we got, we got two purple firefish, one blue tang, one orange sea star, one blood red fire shrimp, one tiger sea cucumber, three cherry barbs, uh, one long fin fairy wrasse, and two dairy bodie loaches. And you know, that's the one that the bag leaked and one's dead and one might make it. And then two or three ignitus antheus. I don't know if it was two or three, I don't remember. And one bag for this tank. <laughs> But man, those cherry barbs are way small. They literally look like teeny little minnows. And it's crazy. Um, yesterday night, these guys were in California. And now they're in a tank in Florida. That's a long little trip. I'm curious to see what else um, died and survived. Hopefully everything's good. I've Read a lot of good reviews of Live Aquaria, so hopefully I get to write a good one other than my loach is. So it's been four hours since we put them in and we have the light back on. And here's the little blue tang. He's like really small. And compared to the other tangs in there, I didn't know he would be that small. But there's the wrasse right there. He just stuck his little head out. Everything is still kind of hiding. But there's the starfish. Looks pretty cool. There's the antheus in the fire. Hey guys, it's a day after I put all the fish in and everything looks like they're doing okay. Here's the two fires. They like to just hang out right here together. The two big tangs and the tiny little blue tang. Wow, his blue does not look good on this camera. But, I mean, he actually has really good colors. He's just really small compared to the other tangs. And here we have one of the antheuses. And the other one is somewhere. Like, he used to be active, but he's just not right now, of course, while I'm one in the video. But I really like these purple firefish. They're really cool. And there's one of the crabs right there. The emerald crabs. There's the, a six line that I got the other day. I never did make a video because I didn't want to make a whole video on one little fish. But I got him the other day. He didn't come in the live aquarius shipment. So we have the six line wrasse and then the red fairy wrasse, which I just saw poke his head out but I don't know where he went. There he is, the red fairy wrasse, or the long fin fairy wrasse, is its full name. But he has nice colors, he has like a cool little blue tail. Ooh. And as in the inverts we got, I don't think the starfish 
is doing all right at all. He doesn't look that good. He's got a chunk missing out of him. And he doesn't look very lively. And the sea cucumber, he disappeared. Hopefully he comes out soon and we'll see if he's okay. But the nice thing is Live Aquaria has a 14 day guarantee for all their live fish and stuff. So, I mean, if anything does die, we can get our refunded. But those fires are really cool. Great size, awesome colors. It's cool when they stick up their little top fin. Let's see if they'll do it. Normally they do it when they get scared or something. But. I don't know why the the male Antheus is so hidden. The female right here, I mean, she doesn't have the best of colors, but I mean, she's not scared of anything now. But give everything a couple days and I'm sure um, everyone will be all right. But thanks for watching. If you have any questions, just ask them in the comments. or um, And also give me ideas on what you want me to talk about in the videos. Like if there's anything you want me to show or discuss or anything. So just let me know. And, uh, I'll s and you can also check out my website at petdude.webs.com. And where I have a bunch of basically all the... Uh, pictures I take of the tank. I have them all on there. So thanks for watching. Bye